Join me today as we take a dive into the world of wire wound resistors and find out what makes them so special, what their key characteristics are, where you can use them, but also the precautions to be aware of. Wire wound resistors are known for their unique characteristics. That's what makes them so special. They're rather different when it comes to comparing them with other resistors. So what I'm going to do is really take a deep dive into them and we can see what they are how they are made and where they can be used to great effect. Wire wound resistors have been used for decades. In fact, they were one of the types used with early radio or wireless as it was called then. But even though they've been around for many, many years, they are still current today and very important. Their technology has moved on and modern wire wound resistors provide really high performance. Today, one of the biggest challenges for resistors is that of heat dissipation. When a current flows through a resistor, it dissipates heat, and this gives rise to temperature increases, which can alter the performance, the accuracy, and so on of many types of resistor. Wire wound resistors are able to handle this heat and the temperature rises very well. And also, they can be designed so that they can be bolted onto heat sinks to carry this heat away and thereby increase their heat dissipation capability. Precision and stability are two other key aspects of, of resistor specifications. And many resistors don't perform well when they are put under stress, when there's lots of heat around. But wire wound resistors are able to provide much better levels of precision and stability, especially when there is heat around. But how do they do this? The key to their performance actually can be found in the name. They actually consist of a wire that's wound round a core, and usually this is made of ceramic. Once the resistor has been wound, end caps are pressed onto the core, and the wires are welded to these caps. Finally, the resistor is encapsulated to prevent moisture ingress, and also to protect it from physical damage. The length of the wire within the resistor, its diameter and the resistivity mean that the resistance of the overall component can be closely controlled. And also the resistance wire used will also generally have a low temperature coefficient of resistance. So it, the overall resistor will maintain its resistance well, even under temperature and stress. Today's resistors are often encapsulated in a ceramic package, or they may even be enclosed within a package that enables them to be mounted onto a heat sink so that the heat can be transferred away. There are many shapes and styles of resistor, as you can see here, and there are even surface mount versions as well, so that they can be used within modern production techniques. The standout features of wire wound resistors are their power handling capacity, their accuracy or precision, and also their reliability. And this makes them essential components for use in many key circuits. In fact, their higher power rating and better heat dissipation levels compared to other resistors means that these resistors are used in many power applications. And power levels or power ratings of a watt and upwards are available. And I've even seen some with power dissipation levels of 100 watts and more. The other aspect of wire wound resistors is their precision, and this enables them to be used in many measurement systems. Here we see an old analog meter that uses a, a wire wound resistor, but they're used also in modern test and measurement systems. Accuracies of these resistors of 0.02% are available, and this means that they are able to perform to the levels required for highly accurate test equipment. Many of these wire wound resistors also have a very low temperature coefficient of resistance, and this means that even over wide variations of temperature, they maintain their resistance levels very well. The downside to these components is that being a wound component, they inherently have inductance in them, and this makes them unsuitable for high frequencies and RF applications. In summary, wire wound resistors play a vital role in modern electronics, particularly where power handling, accuracy and reliability are paramount. 
If you found this video helpful, then please don't forget to check out my other videos on electronics technology, and it would be great if you could subscribe to my channel and like the video. Thank you.